all. This is season five, episode six. So I'm ready to jump right into this episode. As always, it's going to be a full reaction from my seventh third tier here on the YouTube platform, as well as my other platform, Patreon. So guys, please sign up to one of those platforms and help support the channel. Today, I have nothing to say. I have been enjoying this, but we need to be wrapping up Better Call Saul along as well as some other shows that I have here on the channel. So without further ado, let's jump into Better Call Saul and find out exactly what Saul has got to give. Who are you? Oh, this person. Why is she by herself? I think that she rides this. <laughs> What? You were drinking? Uh-oh. Kimmy, it was one beer. Kim, I'm not doing this. Come on, it's cold out. Let's let's go get some food, go home. I'm just gonna walk. Really? You're gonna walk three miles with the cello. Kim, get in the car right now. Ooh. Kim, get in or I'm driving home. Right now, in the car. Don't listen to me. You never Listen! Freedom. Freedom to ride. <laughs> Freedom to explore. Hi. I'm Don Wattell. Hi. President of Mesa Verde. Oh. Ain't that right, Kevin? That's right, Dad. Let our family help find your freedom at Mesa Verde. Uh -huh. You can make it look like the same time period. <laughs> That's great. I love it. You want it when? Uh, as soon as possible. You got 10 spots, I count. 12, 13 locations, and there's posts, graphics, this video effects thing you're talking. And plus we have to lug all our stuff around, and actors, craft service. There's gotta be a way, right? Because we're smart, so we can figure out a way, right? Cut the number of spots. No, it's to use voiceovers instead of actors. Or if we did it all in one location. I just feel like if we just get out there and this, we hustle, we can do it. We can. Dude, can't be done. Mm -hmm. Dude. What if we did the Superman thing? Oh, like a weatherman. Blue screen, I think. Do you mean the green screen? Looking good, gentlemen. You don't need much for a green screen now. Red leather, oh. yellow. Mom makes meat. Mom Red meat. leather, red leather, red. Mom. Yellow, yellow leather. No, no time to do it. Who knows their lines? Yes. Mom I believe I have it. Bring that confidence right over here with this marker on the floor. That's your spot. Also, don't be rigid, okay? Try to be natural. And speak to me. Fear here. There's emotion. You're searching for a hero. But don't hit it too hard. Just throw it away. But with feeling. Heck yeah. This is great. Stand right there. You look great. Five, four, three, two. Magic. Magic. <laughs> you can't have the pizza while we do the thing. Give me that. Bonds. All right, good. Put it down. Nobody's buying it. Okay, the cane, I think, is a little too much. Oh, just really. Okay. <laughs> Smile warmly. No, I'm trying to direct. That's good. Get out of the too much. Uh, put your hand right. Yeah, yeah. Stand on the X. Turn sideways. Take your coke out of her hands. Or make it a whip. Whip your head. Up here, and then go. Action. <laughs> Point. No, like this. Good. Make it look real. And cut. Oh, Kim, we love you, girl. Kim, I'm sorry you missed most of it. I'm almost through my part now. You coming in? Cause hey, we still got a slice or two of pizza left. I, I think I will pass. I just, I just wanted to talk. Talk? Yeah. Track down Olivia Fitzsui. She's. 92 years young. She's part of the Navajo Nation arrangement or maybe a cake assortment from Brothers Bakery. Good Jimmy, idea. Acker settled for 75000 Look, we'll negotiate as far up as we can and then I'll make up the difference. We just need to end this now and move on. But why? Second guessing how you got to be Acker's lawyer and questioning my intentions enough to want me off the case. Here's yeah. the truth. Rich knows nothing. Well, not yet. Not no. ever. It's just not worth it. Uh, it's like watching a walk-off home run just drift foul. It's your play. If you want to walk, we'll walk. So I gotta, I gotta break it to the kids. <laughs> all day at work. Jimmy, you're out here doing all this because of me. I'm helping. 
Hey, nacho cheese. Gus ring. Oh, Mike's here. Ooh. You're Michael? If Hector or the cousins ever find out about They're it. not gonna find out. Lala's using his CI connection. He's having Domingo call the DEA to rat out your dealers. Your guys are gonna get swept up. Promote low-level dealers. Or find new ones. Protect our people. Hitting your supply trucks, going after your restaurants, getting your customers sick, and chip away at your business until the bosses down south don't think you're worth the trouble. Ooh. From now on, you report to this man. He needs you. You do not hesitate. Guessing there's something you want to get off your chest. <laughs> they shot me. Left me bleeding out in the desert all part of some plan. I warned you, when you started going after Hector Salamanca, there'd be others to worry about. You got in with both eyes open. My father didn't. He's got a gun to my father's head. First things first. We take care of Lalo, then we'll talk. Macro's decided to settle. Tell Kevin he's got his call center. Fantastic. Kevin's gonna want to be there to close this out and celebrate. Kim, this was a, another tough one, but you did it. Again. A team effort. We'll email you the details. Rich, you've been nothing but generous to me. And you don't deserve to be yelled at. It was unprofessional. Very. Just that I'm sorry. You have a bone to pick with me, pick away. In fact, you want to lose your shit? That's all right, too. But never in front of the troops. I don't have to spell out what it does for morale, confidence. You and me, we're going to lunch. And everyone is going to see us. I would not want that job. It's so cheap. Is there some kind of damage I'm not seeing? No, we get lots of donations, books we already have, and there's just not enough room on the shelf. My granddaughter's gonna love this. Is there a Lillian Simmons working here? Yes, I'm Lily. Lily? Great. I'm a private investigator. Oh, is this about Travel Wire? A man with a mustache, dark hair, kind of tall. I'm not even sure anymore. I said I told the police everything I could remember. Well, I know. I've been hired by the family. And I am trying to help them find... Looking for closure, Lily. <laughs> Anything to bring them peace. The door sign was flipped closed, which it never was. And then the man pointed at the sign and waved me off. Oh, it was horrible. Thick black smoke and flames. He said that was on fire? With the mustache. Talk about when you first got there. You drove, I assume. Were there any other cars parked there? Um, a few. Older cars, classic cars, something you might not see every day. Lalo has Actually, a different I car. I think there was. Do you remember what kind? Did that look familiar? Is this the car? Um, that's not for me to say. Customized 1970 Monte Carlo. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> a huge help, Lily. Thanks, Thank you Lily. very much. <laughs> if you were able to call the detectives who interviewed you and pass this along firsthand. It was so long ago, I don't think I can remember who I spoke to. Well, I have that right here. Detective Tim Roberts, that's his number. Probably catch him at his desk right now. And if you don't mind, don't mention my name. Please get a little funny about private investigators horning in on their business. Absolutely, I understand. Count your lucky stars, we got Judge Papadumian. She likes my flair. You want a quick rub and tag? Just to say thanks? Ah! Uh, we won't mess up your suit or nothing. Maybe you should take a break. You don't see restaurants closing doors at noon, do you? Lunch uh, is peak traffic. Just Lady, hey! Lady. Hey, um, how much for uh, an hour of your time? I don't want to say it was all luck. Then don't say another word. U.S. Open, here we come. Oh, God, is he going to bother? Well, you're shaking hands with Judge Green. I don't know if you heard about his retiring. He's been filing a different type of brief for the judge now, hasn't you? Very good. Let's hear more about that hole in one. Oh, my God, they're going to go bother whatever his name is. And the gang already had a jump on redrafting the complaint, but then another box of receipts was suddenly discovered. Can I help you? Howie, you know, Joe Dog ain't happy. Mm -mm. You owe us. Uh, owe you? 
Yeah. Oh. I can leave if you need. Uh, uh, no, no. <clears throat> oh. Look. Don't touch her! I don't ask! No, Cliff, these are not my hookers. Huh? There's somebody else's. Why is he doing to this? Oh, Why is he, what, what did Howard do? Went to order him a job. <laughs> Hello, uh, Olivia Bitsui. To ask you, um, have you ever heard of a bank called Mesa Verde? He is just causing chaos. What's that? Sorry. That. How long has it been down there? Ooh. It's an inner office envelope. Isn't there a date? Where's it supposed to be? Today. <laughs> uh, Detective Roberts. Detective Roberts should get it. Sometime? Today? Oh, if it's a human body, yes. I'll investigate. If the porch isn't big enough for you to get under, then there's probably not a dead body. Ed, you need to put eyes on this. This is our travel wire murder. Oh, Check out the make of the car. Who sent this? Officer McFloss? I can't even read that. So, we got a Monte Carlo at a lot here, half hour before the murder, 20 blocks. This is sounding like our guy. I care about getting this behind us. Done. Finito. Hello, folks. Nice to see lots and lots of happy faces. Paige, I know you're the one who brought Kim Wexler onto the team, so I consider you the brains of the operation. I actually think you're right about that. Really looking forward to settling this. Me too. Let's do this. Just to jump into it. <laughs> jump away. <clears throat> 45,000 is more than generous. I hear that, but... Um, you and I have a different definition of the word generous. Let's just hear the number you're looking for so we can all move forward with our lives. What amount are you asking? Four million dollars. <laughs> it's what's fair. What in the world are you talking about? Well, it's four with six zeros, and it's preceded by a dollar sign. And I discussed the offer with my client, and he really, really doesn't want to leave his house. I apologize. We need to end this meeting now so Rich and I can have a conversation with Mr. Goodman. What's your end game here? Because you know you're never going to get that money. Wait, wait, don't leave. Really good. What? You're going to want to see this. Kevin, you want to stick around? Your dad's in this. What? what? Ah! There's on. only one way to find out. Kevin, I'm advising you to please just keep walking. I thought I had a hoodie on. <laughs> what are you doing? My bank took my home over a technicality. And I never missed a single payment. It's not right. If you or a family member been wrongfully evicted from your home by Mesa Verde, then you may be entitled it's to a large cash commercial thing. Are you kidding, you kidding me? You can't hear this. It's libel. It's, it's libel. My father you're making a fool of. I went into my bank to withdraw cash for groceries, and I came out with a rash. I'm Saul Goodman. Did you or a family member visit a Mesa Verde branch and come into contact with black mold? After they run, in New Mexico, oh. Arizona, no, no, Utah, Texas. No, we will Texas. stop it before it ever gets that far. You can stop us. Some news outlet will pick it up. They'll run for free. And stop their genitals. Yep. My dad never, ever did anything like that. Never, ever get that far. Hey. Evidence was as clear as day. My bank was funding terrorism. Yep. Stop. Stop it. It's illegal to do that. No lawyer can play one case off another. It is unethical and it is blackmail. This is... Olivia Bitsui. She's a photographer. In fact, she took the self-portrait. Kim, I got this. Kevin, I'm strongly advising you. I know this picture. My Kevin. dad bought it fair and square. ...that he owns a copy of Olivia Bitsui's photo, a photo that looks remarkably like the official Mesa Verde logo. You don't own the rights to it. That's copyright infringement. You'll never be able to prove that. Looks like a mirror image there. So I think I can convince a judge and probably a jury. Not your fault, sins of the father, but... Um, we filed an injunction. We throw a big tarp over them till we can get this thing settled. Shouldn't take more than, I don't know, a couple years. He just screwed over Cam. Yeah, the problem we're facing is that none of the so-called victims said Mesa Verde no, did this. Said my Mesa bank, Verde they never did used that. The words exactly. Notify the stations that, that 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 they're susceptible to a libel it suit might if be they an extended air. game of whack-a-mole. We, we can start to, with that. That's to discuss the libel. Do not discuss the libel. Kevin, I know you're upset, but please. Don't do anything rash. We'll fix this. Kim, can I just go to the mender? 505-503-4455. Today. You're a third-rate huckster. You'd sell your own mother's organs to get what you want. <laughs> I'm not actually allowed to do any of this. 
Not intentionally. Cut to the chase, jackass. World, you throw in a public apology. American photographer Olivia Bitsui is compensated, in addition to receiving future credit for the inspiration and use of the logo from Mesa Verde. And those commercials, well, they'll never see the light of day. And poof, away they go into a vault. You can open your eyes now. <laughs> can you imagine a world where we shake hands on that? He agreed to it. Yeah, he just dropped me off. The usual route, going south. The cops gonna pick him up. Baker 241 PD, Monte Carlo occupied by one male. Last seen headed south on Brighton towards Lawrence. He is not gonna kill a cop. Turn the vehicle off and drop the keys out now. <laughs> oh, I'm over here for you, girl. It was pretty perfect, right? For sandbagging you with the old switcheroo, I should have warned you. That anger, real anger, it worked like a protective immunity shield, you know? Emotion like that, you can't fake it. No, you can't. He said he was tired of lawyers. Hey, wait, do the voice. You gotta do the voice. Kevin is sick of lawyers, wants to be done with all of it. We'll go to a steakhouse. Get a couple bottles of red wine, she got fired soup, the whole nine yards. She's done. No way that Rich or Paige could believe that we were in cahoots, because guess what? We weren't. Kevin still gets his call center. Everybody wins. You win, Jimmy. Well, we win. Us. No, I didn't. What didn't you get? I don't trust you. Why? Wait, how can you be the sucker? It was your plan. Oh, fuck you, Jimmy. I was just... No, you, you turned you and me versus the bank into you versus me. If I got caught and, God forbid, you're questioned under oath, you have plausible deniability. You can excuse stabbing me in the back by making it about protecting me? It, it will never happen again. That's a lie. It is. Well, I swear. Look me in the eye and tell me it'll never happen again. <sighs> you don't believe yourself. It is a lie. You lie. I lie. It has to end. I, I, I cannot keep living like this. No, 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 no. Jimmy, we no, can shut up. This. Jimmy, Jimmy, either we end this now and enjoy the time we had and go our separate ways, or we're. Or maybe. Maybe we get married. Um. What? Oh, well. So my initial reaction was like, married? Girl. Okay. If that's what you want, you want that, good luck, girl. Um, regardless, this is a very good episode, girl, from start to finish. I actually forgot that we're on episode six, although I said it in my intro. So, honey, I knew this was gonna pick up, pick up, pick up. This was everything that I needed, wanted, and even dreamed of. Dreamed! Um, very good, very good, very good. Um, I can't believe that we're almost done with season five. We're gonna be in season six, and then we're gonna be done with the Better Call Saul Breaking Bad whole world and it's gonna be actually kind of exciting for me because i feel like i've been in breaking bad better call soul world since i started this channel and i'm ready to tie it up with a bow and you know say goodbye to it in such a, a wonderful way i love this show i love these characters um i really do think that kim personally should leave um saw leave him in the dust honey leave him where you found him but we already know that's not going to happen um by the ending of this a series obviously kim and saw are not together because kim was not in breaking bad at all so um new character new issue new story bye bye then we also had the mic situation with Lalo, I believe that's how his name is, or Lalo, whatever his name is, um, and Nacho Cheese, and, and Fring, Fring is getting irritated, Lalo, Lalo, whatever his name is, he's going after Fring, no, no, no stopping him, now he's arrested, he even has a gun in his car, so, um, is he going to jail for a while, will we see him back, I think we're seeing him back before this series ends, and I'm ready to see them turn up, turn up, turn up, okay, I drank a couple of these, so I'm wired. So it's time for me to go. With that being said, guys, if you've seen this reaction and realize you are not subscribed, hit the subscribe button. So please like and share this content because it does wonders for this channel. And I'll see you all next time 
Und Andres Elke.